gentlemen, it's your boy Jesus. Welcome back to another Madden 17 video. And oh my god, have I missed you guys, man? We're back to regularly scheduled programming. I got a little lazy on y'all, man. I can't lie. Oh, look at we're already on Sean Taylor. 99 Sean Taylor will be out later this year. 93 or 90, whatever his overall is. We're about to find out right now. I forgot what his overall is. There he is. We have Sean Taylor out now. And this card looks biblical. You go on ahead, you take a look. 92 speed, 94 acceleration, 86 play rec, 88 tackle, 75 man cover, 88 zone coverage with a 93 pursuit, and 95 hit power. He brings field general, not one, not three, but times two. So he automatically gives you tier one, one excel, one play rec, one pursuit already there. So his pursuit's going to be 94. His play rec is going to be... 87 his excel is going to be 95 so he's going to be extremely fast big hitter tier one is one strength one hit power one tackle and big hitter to do <coughs> excuse me is i believe plus one speed and another hit power if i'm not mistaken so i believe he can have 97 hit power 93 speed this card is going to be astronomically biblical this card is going to be a force to be reckoned with man sean taylor a big fan favorite May he rest in peace. May this young gentleman, who life was taken away, and it's a tragedy to know that this young man is not outperforming each and every single Sunday, showcasing his skills and being a role model for the youths of today. It's a tragedy, man. It's a tragedy. Hopefully, he's looking down upon us, happy to know that we are here representing everything that it is you stood for man and having you on the field definitely a card i want you notice i go to compare you know who's not there you know who's not there let me go to compare again you know who's not there brian dawkins is not there we sold him for 460k sean taylor obviously i made the room for him i gotta let him know listen there's absolutely no type of discrepancy here is that the right term i should listen there's no you don't gotta worry about it you starting damn it I don't need you looking behind your back shoulder. What well, Brian Dawkins doing there, coach? There ain't no Brian Dawkins there. You good. The job is yours. And Brian Dawkins was a beast. I said he was a beast. So, Sean Taylor, I'm expecting to be Brian Dawkins and some. That's what I'm expecting. And we have another legend drop today. The beast, Amon Green. And he potentially looks like the best running back in the game. I need to look at his strength, though. Kevin Green, if you look at the... Damn, he down to 500 already. Damn! All these people pulling greens. Can I get a green tomato, potato, tomato? Can I get one? Okay, so this is why I think he looks like the best running back in the game. <clears throat> Listen to your boy one time. As somebody who runs the ball all day, every day, let me learn you something. So he has 93 truck. I need to look at the strength, though. 81 strength. That is what I'm talking about. That is the strength that he needs to straight bowl over, folks. So he has 92 juking. 93 trucking, 90 elusiveness, 95 ball carry, 88 carry, 93 excel, 90 agility with a 90 speed. And what I think would make him the best running back in the game is that trucking. That trucking is disgusting. Everybody uses Derrick Henry. You know why? Because he'll run your punk ass over. You get near him, they push up on the right thumbstick. And that's it. You're gone. Your soul leaves your body. You see it right in front of you. Shang Tsung style. Your soul just leaves. Goes straight to the Madden Gods, man. No return address or nothing. So they don't even know what to send it back to. This Derrick Henry runs over everything. This I'm on green. 93 trucking. But he has bruiser back times two. So he automatically equips tier one by himself. And you may ask, what does that bring? Well, well, wait. There's more. This is why this is the best runner back in the game. Potentially. Potentially. So he has an 82 stiff arm. Bruiser back tier 1 and tier 2 will give you two stiff arms. So he's going to jump up to 84. You're also going to receive two trucking for equipping tier 2 of bruiser back. So that trucking is now a 95 with 90 speed. This is Derrick Henry with a splash of speed and more trucking and more juking and more elusiveness. Plus 10 elusiveness. 
So that elusiveness and that trucking at potentially 95 is going to make this card. I believe I got to see how he plays. I got to see how he plays because I said the same thing about Tony Dorsett. It looks like a bit. Boom! Tony Dorsett. Now, let me stop. Boom! No, he had a few. Boom! He's a bum. He's a bum. Choose which cheek. Left cheek, right cheek. He's ass. He's cheeks. This card, I got to see how he plays. But on paper, it looks like he could be the best running back in the game. And I think he has what it takes to be the best running back. Just just look at the 95 trucking, though. This man, is he should be running over everybody. He should. He should. If he falls forward with that trucking, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. I got to see how he plays. I got to see, see how he plays. I got to see how he plays. I got I got to see how he plays because he might not run over nothing. But if he's Derrick Henry, what he looks like he is with just a splash more speed. And just a nice coating of more trucking. It can go up. It can be a beast, man. Up to 95 trucking, man. And I'm definitely going to get him. And I'm going to start him. I think he will be better than Le'Veon. For the fact of... See, now Le'Veon does truck people. But not consistently. Every once in a while. You know, you put the shoulder down. He'll run somebody over. Every once in a while. Derrick Henry, by far, does more than anybody I've been able to use. Um, Adrian Peterson does a pretty good job of it too, but n still nobody does it like Derrick Henry. And trucking and stiff arm is definitely the way to go this year. So if you got somebody with high trucking, like Adrian Peterson or Derrick Henry, and battle ready, you know, you hit the stiff arm, and then if you're tapping A, and it happens to be a tackle battle, you're already pressing the A button, so you got the advantage you're going to break the tackle. And that's what Amon Green has, so we'll see, we'll see. But I'm definitely looking forward to seeing how he does. I'm also really interested in getting that Sean Taylor see how he does it too. Those are today's new legends. I'm going to try my best to pull them. Hopefully, I can get lucky. Uh, let me know what you guys' thoughts are down below in the comment section. It's your boy, Jess, man. And I'll see you guys next video. Peace!